Hey everybody, Donald with Top Wolf Outdoors and this video is Alice Pack Loadout Part 3. Hey right, guys, sorry it's taking so long in this uh, endeavor, but with the stuff going around, uh, it's either just been busy, sorry, I'm going to try and and get back to this channel, I definitely missed it, I'm ready to get back outdoors, ready to go, do a lot of stuff, so with that in mind, let me go ahead and uh, get into this part three of my Alice Pack loadout, ready to get back out there in the woods. Uh, I haven't decided on the sleeping yet. It's either going to be my hammock or a tent or the bivy. Stay tuned for that. We'll find out. Uh, first, let me get started with my U.S. canteen. I'll have a couple of these, as always, and a third collapsible pouch with uh, water purifications. Uh, throughout my kits and everywhere my, my clip kind of broke on this kind of just broke off but uh, I'll take care of that before I go I uh, just gotta just gotta get it out of there this uh, US canteen I got but there's a lighter in there still always I'm gonna double check your equipment and Everything you got, see, that still works. Multiple ways of uh, starting fire, as always, in this endeavor. And make sure I got that the right way. You know, make sure it doesn't leak all your uh, fluid out. So that's the the first thing there is the uh, canteens water situation. Uh, next. Uh, the personal kit, TP and all that other fun good stuff. Uh, this has always been my go-to bag on that. It's always ready to go. This is my travel travel personal kit. Uh, kind of go through this quickly. Always have headlamp everywhere. There's a towel. Let me run through this quickly. Always baby powder. Gold bond. You know it's hot, sweat, fat guy like me. Uh, there's some body wash, underarm deodorant. Sorry if I'm going through this too quickly, but I'm kind of showing what I have. I got a uh, got to take care of your teethers out there. This is the, uh, the large pack one I got. Uh, probably throw in some new toothpaste in there. Got to take care of your teeth. Got to take care of you. As I said, you know, there's another lighter. Multiple ways of uh, starting fires everywhere. Uh, got some hand sanitizer. Definitely come in handy for this time of what we have going on. So. More hand sanitizer. Got one of these light sticks. You gotta gotta see when you go. Of course, a uh, roll of uh, the TP. And then we got some more. What do we got here? Some shampoo. You know, keep the hair clean. So, all razor packs, clean shave, and uh, with that, yeah, some old uh, Barbersol. And this here's one of those do not eat packs. Just leave it in there to keep moisture out, I guess. So that's my personal bag I'm going to take out with me. Kind of covers everything that I need. Uh, and then some 
roughing it smoothly. Alrighty, stay tuned. Uh, be right back for the uh, the next part. Alrighty, we're back. Uh, hope everybody's doing well out there and being safe. So my cook kit is always always carried in my my messenger bag, and when I get out to my location, I can change this bag up a little around if I need to go scouting. I can throw my uh, small stuff that I need for doing a scout. If I'm just doing a small hike away from my main camp, I'll have this. So, naturally, fire. Double check it, it's good to go. And this front pouch, knife sharpener. Keep your knife sharp. And honed is always a good thing. Over here, got uh, some more hygiene. It looks like uh, yeah, these on-to-go little toothbrush. Got some chapstick in here. Another way of starting fire. Little cardboard extra helped for making and starting a fire. Uh, before I get into these containers here, for my fuel, for my cooking, it's the heat and the yellow bottle. For my stove, carry. Two bottles in here and then there's going to be a bottle in my main pack someplace so I'll have three of these bottles plenty enough to get me through a, a weekend easily uh, just gonna run through it all here this here's my flint and steel fire kit fire more fires I'll do a separate video on this uh, a new video on my fire kit that'll be with me some bug repellent not a sponsor but any bug repellent you got a, a life straw survival water filter for out there if needed for my knife that I carry, fair seam rod, this is my light my fire. Definitely been used. I'll probably clean this up here, but light my fire with my leather sheath that I made. Fair seam rod. Make sure you don't lose that. Multiple ways of starting fire and in the in the end, there's a fair seam rod in there. So that'd be the knife. Yeah, you know, let's kind of move this out of the way for a minute. Uh, carabiners and a zipper pull, or who knows? There's another water filter purification. Always with me, and my titanium spoon. Always carry with me. Love this titanium spoon. Uh, you know, tin foil, tin foil, wind conditions for the stove. Uh, extra empty baggy. A trash bag that's in there. Lays all up there in the bottom. And, uh, that's it for the bag, and this is my cook kit. My titanium pot. Lid. Two, uh, two pots. A big and a small pot. Titanium. 
Tatankas titanium. It's been great. Probably give that a wash out, quick wash out before I go. And then uh, small cup. This uh, this setup has been uh, has been great. Let me tell you. Lid, all titanium. It's going to be with me forever. And this is my alcohol stove that I use. It's been my my go-to alcohol stove to go with the heat and the yellow bottle. So this stove here has been uh, has been excellent. Uh, I have two more for a backup, which I'll probably throw a backup stove in the main bag someplace to have. So I'll have two stoves. One is none, two is one, all that kind of jive. So that's my uh, my old cook setup and personal hygiene bag with everything I'm going to need make sure you uh, take care of your cutting tool very important water purification multiple ways and yeah, as I said starting fires multiple ways so, alrighty, let me uh, put this back together and let's uh, get out of this video. Alrighty, everybody, uh, thanks for sticking with me. Uh, once again, I'll be getting back out here to my outdoor channel. I definitely missed it. So stay tuned for some more videos up and quick. Got a lot of things planned and coming. So, I appreciate your views, your comments, and any suggestions always. Y'all stay safe out there, and we'll see you in the next coming video.